So as soon as the main card starts tonight, they start to preview, obviously, the main, the co-main. Well, they get to the co-main, they start talking about the Benavidez Formiga fight, which is a fight between the number one and number two ranked contenders at flyweight. Dana White just recently stated that they're going to keep the flyweight division when we really didn't know if that was going to, this division was going to stay around at the beginning of the year for various reasons I'm not going to get into at the moment. But Cejudo, we all know, flyweight, bantamweight champion. This fight tonight, big number one contender fight. And you get this impression from Dana and the UFC that they're going to keep this division. Well, you start. I, they showed the rankings for this fight, and they only showed the top five. And at number five ranked, as the number five ranked contender in this division, they had Tim Elliott. And I knew that that wasn't right. Tim Elliott was ranked a lot lower than that. And then I, so I quickly pull out my phone and I look up the rankings and they have 12 ranked contenders in this division. They don't even have a top 15. In every other division, other than women's featherweight, they have a champion and then 15 ranked contenders. At this current moment right now, they have 13 people ranked in the flyweight division. And then when you look at these upcoming cards, there's really no, very, very few and far between flyweight fights. This, it's not, Henry Cejudo is keeping this division alive. Let's make no mistake about it. And this fight tonight's very pivotal, I think, to the future of this division because they're clearly not expanding it. And I think we might see a flyweight title fight after this between the winner tonight and Cejudo, but after this, who knows?